the little video at Rex. It's been poorly for the past uh, 24 hours. Um, again, I think it's the water, you know, the river where it's been going. Because I think twice when he's been there, he's been sick. So, yes, you have. So I'm going to keep him away from there. Because so obviously, we've heard about like the sewage and that, what's been planted in rivers and at beaches. You know, it's like we can't take him in anywhere these days. I'm watching what he eats. He's been eating a lot of grass. But um, it's just sickness. He's found in himself around the vets. Bloody hell, £150 without medication. Bloody hell, yeah. Um, so I said I'd monitor him because them were the only signs he had. Um, sickness, he was finding himself, wet nose, I checked his gums, I checked his temperature, which was horrible, but I had to do it, and he was fine. So I thought before I paid £150, I'll actually see if I can, you know, set, get him well at home. Um, I'd have paid it, of course I would, if he'd have had more symptoms. Like I said, everything else was fine. I'd have gone me out. You're tangled. Come here. I'd have gone me out something. Um, you know. Oh, come here. I'm saving up for a um, nice dress. It's my sister's wedding on the 27th of May. But I'd have got a cheaper one in order for Rags to get his, uh, to go to vets. You know, so the money was there for him. It's just, is it worth paying when he could be better the next day? And I'm going to monitor him and hopefully... It's not going to be, a, it's not as, nowhere near as expensive today. It's £50 for the uh, consultation, which is a lot of money. But compared to 150 without meds, it is quite a difference. So anyway, that's, is is okay now. I'm just going to take him to the pet place with his biscuits. I've been feeding him little and often, like the vet said. He said, don't change his diet, don't give him scrambled eggs or rice. Some people do that. He said, just feed him little and often. So that's what I've been doing. Okay, bye.